Yeah, now, look, this little phrase of it, that he says, I will make them joyful in my house of prayer. And then it's answered by the phrase right after it. And their offerings, their prayers, their worship will be pleasing to me. Sometimes it reads acceptable, but you got to translate it, a relationally pleasing thing. So you find this back and forth. It's a full-on relationship. Imagine that with God. So, so he's going to make us joyful, and we're going to offer him that which he delights to be pleased. This is, this is relationship. Now, this is what our hearts are yearning for, to somehow get in on genuine joy. And genuine joy goes back and forth where there's authenticity and God himself being delighted just because he loves to be delighted and him somehow inclining us to be joyful in his joy. So, you know, uh, 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 I remember that phrase sometimes I say, every time I feel the spirit moving in my heart, I pray. Well, if I waited till I felt the spirit moving in my heart, I would, I would like pray like twice in my life, I think. <laughs> so, so our best prayer is always intentional. And so get you to the house. Come to God. Bring yourself in worship. He wants to make you joyful in the house of prayer. Not, but, but don't, he's not trying to make you joyful so that you come. He, the joy is in the coming. Joy is in the doing, the lingering and the offering, the worship and, the, and, 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 and crying out for the things that are on his heart. And so uh, it's not like this is a happy, happy uh, feeling place. It, it's, it's a profound joy when you recognize the significance, the substance, the beauty of this thing, that God himself is, is finding great joy in this. He's so pleased. He's the easiest person in the universe to please because he's so inclined to be delighted in those that bring him true offerings of worship, their authenticity, they, pray, they don't hide anything, they bring, come as you are. It's the only way you can come to the house of prayer. And you're going to find that he gives you and instills in you an authentic joy. It may be un unfold over periods of time. It will come, it will go. You don't do this because you feel like it. You do it because it's worthy and it's wondrous and it's valuable to him.